Hello everybody, good afternoon. In this uh, second Sunday of our factory and uh, this afternoon uh, we are really happy and proud to have uh, the um, master class with the head of the Bolshoi Young Artist Program, Maestro Dimitri Vdovin. As you can understand, Maestro Vdovin cannot be here for all the restrictions that we are having, unfortunately, in this period in every part of the world. So he is uh, in Russian and uh, he, he, he is, will do this master through video, but uh, we are going better and better with technology. So I guess it right. will be more than fine. So we will ask the first student to come, which is Connor Prendville. Uh, here he is. Uh, okay. Hello. And, uh, Hi, Connor. Hello. Have a good and afternoon. Just before you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Rosetta. And just a couple of words before Connor you start your life, but. Uh, it's a big honor for me because we are broadcasting in, in YouTube. It's important to say that, but uh, it's a big honor for me to to work for the Wexford Festival. Of course, I have such a pity that they cannot be, you know, in life here. But anyway, uh, I, I try to do all my best. And it also, it's a great uh, a team. And it's an honor to be a part of this great team. And lucky you, young singers and pianists who have such a wonderful chance to work with this extraordinary specialist and uh, uh, human being personalities. Uh, I just feel it, <laughs> but I hope next year I will join you in private. Thank for sure. You for that. Thank you. And Connor, um, uh, it's great that you brought one of the most famous uh, Russian uh, areas for our tenor. Lensky area from uh, the beginning. Am I right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Yes. Let's try. Sure. <laughs> Ultra Lu 
почтенницы. И злой играет яркий день, А я, быть может, и я гробницы Сойду в строительственную сень. Сердечный друг, желанный друг, приди, приди, желанный друг, приди, а твой супруг, приди, а твой супруг, приди, приди, я жду тебя, желанный друг. Твой супруг, куда, куда, куда вы удалились, Злодие дни, злодие дни мои. It's a, it's a good situation here with the Russian pronunciation and the concepts of Russian physics. Uh, despite of some uh, mistakes uh, in pronunciation, that's absolutely relevant, absolutely reasonable, because it's quite complicated language for singing and unusual, really. Uh, but despite all of that, you know, all your words, all your sentences are clear, and Russians would understand each word. That's, I think it's very important. It's very important. Thank you. But you know, I believe, I believe it's a, it's a, it's a very wrong way when we try to be very misty in our pronunciation. We are not confident in the in the language of the pronunciation, and it happens very often. You know, but you are very brave on that, <laughs> and probably even too brave. <laughs> you are trying to be more too precise. And uh, as I told uh, before, uh, while you all of you were singing Russian repertoire, you know, uh, it's typical for foreigners to be very precise. Yeah. And Russian language is a little bit lazy. Okay. So we have so many consonants, and especially in Tchaikovsky's music, you know, each note needs uh, a different syllable. So too many words. And this is a big problem how to sing Tchaikovsky. 
but he was really appreciated by poetry, by, by text. You know, for him, it was incredibly important. Uh, like for all composers uh, who work not just in opera, but also in the chamber music, sure. who created so many great uh, art songs. You know, this combination for composer can be the same way combination for singers. If he would like to be very attentive for the text, for the meaning what we are singing, you have to combine opera singing and uh, chamber singing. Sure. And each part of, of singing helps to each other. So we are getting more flexible, more deep uh, when we are singing art songs. And we, uh, we, 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 we bring it, we bring it into the opera. Sure. And the same, a good support, a good projection, a big gestures you bring to art songs, and it makes us, if you don't exaggerate, of course, it makes us stronger. Sure. So, and in the same for Tchaikovsky as a composer, and his music is based on the, uh, a little bit old fashioned Russian uh, 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 saloon art songs. Understand what I mean? And, and this is a very special color. Of, uh, uh, of his uh, uh, creations. It's a little bit sentimental. It's a little bit sentimental. And as I told before, we always have to, to keep this good measure. To be sentimental as Russians are, you know, like just in the movie, we are very aggressive, but in the private, <laughs> we are very sentimental. Sure. And, but, but don't be too whining over sad and yeah, yeah. Like that, that is out of out of the good things. Sure. And uh, it's very important uh, your posture. How do you look during this uh, during this singing during the interpretation of this aria? Uh, despite of the very sad moments that when it happens, you must be relaxed. You must be relaxed because uh, the singing line follows a little bit the violin. It sounds like a violin. It looks like a violin line in the, in the scores. And it's the same when the violinist is very you know, tense, you know, it yeah. immediately reflects on the quality of his sound, of your sound. Uh, it's a little bit the same with you. Uh, as, as I made the advice before, you must be very attentive for your work and very insisting uh, with your work uh, in front of the mirror. Sure, yeah. yeah. It's my my favorite sentence. That it's the, 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 mo the most honest and the, uh, and it's for free. It's <laughs> the most honest a teacher in the world. And working with the mirror will help you a lot because sometimes the line is beautiful and the voice is impressive. But look at your uh, left hand. It's permanent, a little fast, and your hand creates a very, very similar movement during the hour. Yeah. And I believe it will be the same uh, in the entire opera. Sure. And immediately, yeah. immediately, it makes your presence on the stage a little bit monotone and strange because all your movements, all your body language, must be reasonable. It it needs to mean something. So uh, I, <laughs> as we talked before, you never know what the stage director will figure out for you in the new production. And probably it happened with some of my students uh, in the production. You know, just swim or just walking in the in the swimming pool. Yeah. One my. Uh, a student now is very famous, very talented. He became uh, he became sick after this production because it, it, it happened in Vienna. It didn't happen at the swimming pool. But we are talking about real general Pushkin's and Tchaikovsky idea. So you are sitting, you are sitting on the tree, you know, on the on the winter field, the field because you know this is a place for dwell. And just thinking about your 
the good ground of your mouth about this this girl. So your body shouldn't be so tense. Yeah. And try to try to try to um, uh, to find out. Sure. As for tempest, these are pretty well. And uh, let's talk about some pronunciation pronunciation moments that is very important. Now, first of all, you have to put as as much as possible like and legato in this time. Yeah. And probably just some speaking phrases and some climax could be more, uh, how can I say, uh, more questionating. But you think about the sound of violin or cello as you do. Okay. Then, despite it's a sad aria and sentimental music, don't whine so much. <laughs> don't, don't, sure. yeah. Don't yeah. whine, don't whine, because it's it's another color. Okay. Remember, Lenski, he comes from the high society, he's aristoc uh, 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 from aristocracy, and he graduated from Heidelberg, Heidelberg University. He's an extremely educated person, and he's a poet. And his hands, he has a very good taste. And even in the moment of uh, in the tragic moment of his life, he still keeps it. Sure. And this situation, it's like Italian music, Italian opera. Everything in Italian opera, I mean, romantic, uh, 19th century Italian opera, everything should be beautiful. Even death, you know, sickness, uh, and another private property. Everything is beautiful. Okay. Uh, just think about it. Uh, what we did do, probably it's better to start again, and I will stop you when we will see some pronunciation sure. uh, moments. Do you mind? No, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, let's start with a very big one. Yeah. Stop, 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 stop. Uh, this, this is not set. This is S. This is, this is, it's not uh, such, a, such a voice consonant. Sure. And then Kuda. You shouldn't be so lost and so sad. And so uh, it's not uh, complete. Okay. It just, it just that where, where did you disappear? Uh, the golden days of my springtime. This is just a question. Don't complain. Okay. Don't run. Okay. And try to be a little bit. Try. Uh, I hope this expression is not so rude to one. Please forgive me some uh, language language color that I can use incorrectly. Anyway. Uh, so kuda should be sung not loud piano, but musically. Okay. Like a man, yeah. The same thing. Yeah. And and you you shouldn't you shouldn't use so much this uh, complaining by the colors in German. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Again. Kuda, kuda. Kuda. Kuda, kuda vui uda lilis, vesni moje, zlati jedni. Good, good, not so bad, just some, uh, some ideas about pronunciation. Uh, uh, moje, you have to to complete this word by yot. No maye, maye, this is a kind of uh, quasi-consonant. Maye, maye. 
obviously my way. Yeah. Uh, the lot three a.m. and this word also has this lot between two between e and a. Zlatinje. It's not Zlatinje. Zlatinje. Also yacht. The Russian language has a lot of yachts. Okay. You understand what, uh, what does it mean? Yeah. Make it sense? Yeah. So yachts is a, the kind of uh, J glide. Sure. Like in English, like in English word, yes. Yeah. And I, uh, I, I would like to demonstrate for our listeners uh, in YouTube a wonderful, a wonderful brochure, a wonderful book that's devoted to uh, pronunciation in Russian opera. You know, the author of this uh, conception is Anton Belov. I don't know this wonderful man in private, but it's a great job. Yeah. And I have to say that it's a really, really, very fruitful support for each singer who would like to sing Russian repertoire. It's absolutely correct. And just in the beginning of this area, we have said many yachts, and we have to put it on the right place. Kuda, 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 So, uh, this yacht is like very short E, but with the closing of the, the, the exam. Understand? Yeah, sure. Like, yes. Sure. Uh, could you repeat, Zlatinje? Zlatia. Right. Uh, <laughs> my yay. My yay. Right. Just okay. try to use it and sing it. Sure. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, you have such a good, you know, such a good pitch. Uh, let, let's repeat just for the break because we are limited in time. Vesni my yay. Zlatia. Vesni my yay. Zlatia. Dni. And sing it now, not ne. 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 This is clear. Ne. Soft N and clear E. Ne. 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 Yeah, ne. Okay. Uh, could you sing it? Just this way. This name I use like the Um, Can I get the. Uh, C, C, La, B, C, A. This name I use like the Now, this is just one note. Just very simply. It needs in days to like Italian all the word D. Sing in Italian. D. Deep. 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 And now just put an knee. Deep. Bravo. It's absolutely correct. Okay. Uh, uh, let me miss uh, three bars and just the, the beginning of uh, Aria, a tempo. Что день грядущий не готовит. Okay. Mm -hmm. Что день грядущий не готовит. Не вой мой взор напрасно ловит. В глубоком слове. No, very good. Very good. Just two small mistakes. Uh, грядущий. Upcoming, it's upcoming. Uh, the, the correct pronunciation is not up, uh, it's just because we are lazy and uh, we wouldn't like to open our mouth so much because we have a cold climate, we have a frost around us sometimes, so we must be very careful with our voices. So, if this is Gredush. this is between I and A, it's even more A, but not so close. Gredush. Gredush. And in the in the word Yevo, you put extra yot, and we don't need it here. Okay. It's not Yevoi, it's not Yevoi, it's just Yevo. 
Yevo. I'm a sinner. Just Yevo, Yevo, my soul, my personality. Глубоко и кинета и все. Okay. So, uh, the entire phrase was okay, but should we repeat it again or we can move on because, you know, we don't have so much time? Uh, whichever you prefer. I'd Would you like to repeat? Yeah, sure. Yep. Okay. Что деньги ведущие мне дадут? Sure. Try to. Try to cut it off. Uh, yeah. 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 that you have to put in Tchaikovsky line and uh, such a number of words. Anyway, it should be Okay. Don't push so much these consonants and it will be fine. Okay, then. Okay. Up, 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 up. Sorry. Complicated, but it uh, it is a very typical color for correct Russian pronunciation. If you see the big O, it means that it's more R. So it sounds like gluboka, gluboka, gluboka. So as as I told before, it has a wonderful quality of Russian singing, but very good face. So we wouldn't like to to move so much by our lips to 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 complete the the absolutely clear O. So, so we don't pronounce O like the Italians. O. It's not O. Or it's, and especially it's not German, very dark O. This is like Roboca. Does it sound like O? Okay. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> it doesn't sound like sure. O. No. So, Roboca. 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 Sure. Sure. Uh, the word from Zomi is really very complicated, but I would like to uh, uh, to attract your attention for your hands. Be careful with hands. Be yeah. careful with hands. I understand what you would like to do. So you would like to concentrate the line. You would like to express your phrase by hands. But in some sense, on the stage, this kind of uh, unreasonable movements, the, this is the sort of compensation of breath control. Yeah, okay. The yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, if you, if you feel not so confident enough with your singing and your breath control and the working of your body, your entire body, not just vocal cords, not just the articulation, uh, not just the, the, the entire body, uh, 
if you don't, we, we don't feel absolutely confident with that. We start to exaggerate with some unreasonable gestures. And in Russia, it's also, we don't have, we don't use so much gestures like Italians or French people. Yeah. Understand what I mean? Yeah. So we don't do it that. Sure. And, okay. and you know, it's 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 not it, it's not uh, complaining it's not crying it's not whining but in a way this is this is a prediction of his death and and he sings like a, a march 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 yeah, yeah like a march yeah you understand that? yeah he understand that it's he's over he's over yeah. this is the reason of the minor this is the reason of the the this uh, feeding feeding phrases and feeding final of this army. Sure. So you have to relax. Okay. You have to relax. It's like you're entering in the in another world in this side. It's your gate into the another world. Sure. And don't be don't be aggressive, don't complain for it, just accept it. Just ex tragically accept it. Okay. Okay, let's go on. Uh, I guess uh, about the word uh, uh, uh Could we sing it in another, another one more time? Padu uli yastre wo pranzion. Yep. Uh, so top of. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Padu uli yastre wo pranzion. Yeah, please cut off this yacht. This is from Franzion. It doesn't exist. Franzion. Franzion. And this is a typical mistake of Russian language. And you, all of you who would like to see Russian literature, and I believe this is beautiful music, uh, you have to remember. You have to. Uh, it's it's very complicated to to remember all these regulars and rules uh, because for that you have to speak the language, but you have to follow very attentively the advice from these transcriptions from this book by Mr. Duo, and it, he is very correct with that. Sure. He never because in some transcription transcription uh, it, it's done wrong. They do okay. this, but it's not correct. Uh, the problem is that just soft consonant before, trans, it's not zon, transion. And pay attention for double M. Transion, transion. Like in Italian language, double consonants, especially double voiced consonants, help us to keep a resonated line in, in, in our interpretation. Sure. Okay, so let's go, let's move on because you know we have to, to go through. Uh, and now it's not difficult to start uh, later. So let's start again. Uh, Padu Uri Yastri So many words again. Yeah. But you have you have to create a wonderful life with these words. Okay. Anyway, this is this is art. This is cantata. This is canto. And you, I understand that it's pretty complicated. But 
you have to complete the group. So, big number or consonants and words. And it's very important for that. This is tricky stuff. Uh, uh, could you repeat? So, Blaga, DNA is not before the chest of the Gilo. And don't push any consonant. Just put it, just uh, spin it with, with the vocals. Understand what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sure. Just soft B, soft B, and A, that's it. Blagoslavian, in the same, in the same mistake with the word D, Jor, D. Okay. It's not D, A. It doesn't exist here. D, just soft D, and A, D. Could you repeat? Uh, repeat after me. Blagas, D, D. Ден. 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 Yeah, good. Весны приход. Let's move on. Sure. Uh, Весны за утро обуждение. Фокус триджендо, and then you more so, but not aggressive. Yeah. Just a little bit more passion, sure. not aggressive. Okay. Весны за утро обуждение. Not bad, not bad. But in some phrases, you have to pay more attention for uh, 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 strong syllables. Okay. Strong syllables. So, а я быть может. But может it means maybe. So, может it maybe. So it's a little bit longer. It's a little bit longer. Sure. It should be eight, uh, but it was a little longer. Your gravity. Consider, uh, uh, consider this uh, strong syllables slung slightly longer, uh, like Italian or Japanese. And the same thing, yeah. and it will be correct. Sure. Of course, okay. this is the question of measure, but all that we are doing is the question of measure. Okay. Yeah. But it should be like that. Sure. And also, it also uh, be more precise with the uh, the vowel u. Uh, ultra. It means morning. This is clear u, not u, not o, just u. So, repeat, repeat. Ultra. Ultra, right. Ultra. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. And if you're not sure about uh, the pronunciation for U or U, just remember that it reminds a little bit the, the movement and intention of kids. Ultra. Ultra. Right. Okay, let's go on. И память юного поэта поглотит медленно. Not bad, not minya, no cut off in minya. Soft N and A, minya. Not bad. And double M, medlenya, medlenya. Yeah. 
But in general, not that. Not T, T, Olga. Not T, T, Olga. It's, uh, it's, it was not bad. It was not bad. Excuse me for church. Okay. But it's an important question uh, for Russian pronunciation and singing. This very strange letter E. Do you see that? It's uh, like uh, it's like that. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you see? Yeah, yeah. Don't be afraid. Despite it's unusual for your new one. Don't be afraid. This is a this is a small detail. So it's see it like E. This tube loud, so it's a little closer to E. Mm. Listen. Not and never put it back. It's okay. always firm. Sure. That's a small diphthong of the way of um loud. Just two points uh, yeah. on the top of this one. And this this combination, this diphthong is so good for pianissimo. Yeah. Try it. Not me. Not me. Not bad. You have to use the name Olga. A little bit soft. Otherwise, it sounds a little too, too rude for me. Oh, God. No. And it's getting too bad on the. On the Surface of your tongue. Olga. Yeah, concentrate on the T of your tongue. Sure. Mm -hmm. Again. Not and you see, yeah, no, 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 good. Probably T to A. T, mm -hmm. a little bit. Uh, Irish, Irish color. <laughs> sure. T. Yeah. T. Yeah. Oh, I try to, knowing that I'm coming to, to Westwood during the quarantine, I tried to study Irish. <laughs> you know? <laughs> and, you know, I stopped just on the Irish names. Oh, wow. Yeah. Sure. So, Irish names are so complicated. Yeah. So, you know, uh, it's not because I'm doing master classes uh, in Ireland, but I have so many colleagues, Irish colleagues. Sure. For instance, including my dear friend, uh, Brenda Hervey. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. A very famous Irish pianist who was the head of the uh, uh, studio in Zurich when I spent for her years as a guest teacher, and now she's working in London. Uh, we have a lot of common stuff between two nations. Uh, first of all, very difficult language, very special language, and uh, and I hope, I think so, a sense of humor. <laughs> yeah. And this is the reason why Irish Irish writers, play writers, and poets are so popular in Russia. When I was young, you know, in each theater we have a. Uh, Bernard Shaw plays, and as far as I remember, Bernard Shaw was uh, Irish by by his uh, two daughters, and um, and also and of course uh, and uh, Oscar Wilde. As far as I remember, he also had Irish shorts and many many. Of them. So don't worry, the, the the language is not easy, but the, your first point that you have to think about that. No, don't use so much efforts sure. trying to 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 come through that. Sure. Relax. It's it doesn't mean that it should be missed. No, it should be a little bit, you know, slightly you know around. No. But don't push constants. And it will help you because Russian music, you know, is very is full of melody. Sure. And the second one. Okay. Uh, and let's move on. Скажи, придешь ли девушка с этим? Sure. 
I'm sorry for talking so much. No, no, I think it's more useful because anyway, this is online and the connection uh, doesn't doesn't help me to be involved so much in some aspects of the scene. Understand what I mean? Yeah, yeah no, but I believe this information from the uh, from from Russian Russian speaker and Russian musician is important for your uh, future work in Russian repertoire. No, sure, it's it's good. Go ahead. Probably you don't remember anything. I hope so. Скажи, придешь ли делать It's you sound it's a little bit cry. It's too much cry, too much whining in the city. Okay. You have to consider Lensky as Vertel. Lensky is a poet, Vertel is a poet, and the both of them are in the same situation. Okay. But is it what do you think is it possible for Vertel? It's not possible. It's, anyway, it should be beautiful singing. Beautiful singing. You have to understand the sense. But, you know, the composer said so much in his, in his line, in his music. Don't put so much spicy stuff in there. <laughs> understand sure. it? Yeah. Don't exaggerate. Don't over salt it. Okay. Uh, and then, Aska, Aska, Ridosh, no, here, just soft D and E. Ridosh, not Ridosh. Ridosh. We have enough letters in our language. <laughs> Don't put extra. Sure. And then, Slezu, it should be U. Not Slezo, not Slezu. Rali, not Rani, Urma. Urma. You must be, you must be in love with clear U in Russian language. Okay. Could you repeat? Yeah. Скажи, придёшь? Скажи, придёшь ли дева красоти? Слезу пролит над ранней орной on me, on me, You know, it's very interesting. It's very similar to the other one. You know, be attentive for double and single consonant. Mne, please, E doesn't exist in this one. Just soft N and A. Okay. And it's, a, it's a, the most, the, the biggest mistake of everybody from uh, foreigners who, who says, Mne, Tibye, uh, no, Mne, Tibye. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
You know, you have to put all your softness in the pronunciation of the name of your girlfriend. So, so she's so cool that you can wait to spoil her. You produce her. And then, Poka Poka Krishna and Stranger, the Sardish Nidu. Sure. Yeah. Sardish Nidu. The first set stop stop stop. Sergeyevsky, 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 First one is stronger, so it's yay. It, should, it shouldn't, it, it shouldn't be the same. Yay, yay, it's sure. yay, yay. And the opposite in Russian just uh, just changes the places. Yeah. It's like Italian, Italian beginning this French pronunciation. <laughs> uh, as for the climate of this area and this A class. It's not such a high note, but this, uh, but you shouldn't push and you shouldn't sign the voice back. So the Marjello, for me, it sounds from the end stage, because it's online, but it sounds like your, your vowel is going back. Okay. And you know, in this situation, probably you have to think a little bit more about Uma. Okay. But not over jacket. Not over jacket. It's just the shape of the vowel yep. that helps you to connect with the breast and to send the sound for Sure. Uh, finishing this area because we, we use all our all of our time. Sure. Could you repeat? Je. Yes. This is the climax. It should be quite a bit sound. Yeah. But make this kind of disposition, disposition a little bit more vertical, but forward. Okay. Okay. Yes. Jelani Druk, Pedia Poisuka. Just from here. Jelani Druk, Pedia Poisuka. Pedia Poisuka. Stop, 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 stop. It's very important the consonant assimilation in Russian language. So it's not so broad. It's like in German. When, when we have the last G, it sounds like K. So broke, broke. Yeah. It's very important. And and sure. then, when you sing, you have to think also a little bit more about forward, forward that U. Yeah. Understand? Okay. Yeah. Because it's not, it's not just a technical um, uh, approach. It's just because of this area, because of the sentimental color of this area. Yeah. If it would be a little bit more positive, we would change. Uh, our walls on another way. Sure. Could you try again? Yeah. Yeah. Forward. 
pretty, pretty, a little bit clever, but not very clear. Either. Put just a drop, like like uh, the, in the terms, you know, just a drop in the medicine of e. Sure. And this this drop of you, it's like a drop of uh, romanticism. Yeah. The drop okay. of romanticism. And the second, like it's a little, there's like a fading, it's like fading, it's, a, it's getting uh, quite far. Sure. A little like echo, like echo of your love. Pretty, pretty, a person. Pretty, pretty. And here and here it has like in the in the beginning of this area the capillary. So instead of uh, my it should be my sure. a little bit uh, the stable Yeah. And usually when we are getting uh, getting the master in voce and the pu piano and fading, think about this kind of rounding of the of the wall. Sure. Make sure. it sense? Yeah. Make yeah. it sense? Yeah. I'm so lucky to you, oh my gosh. Okay. Zlati, let me my boy. The last one. Zlati, let me my No, 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 it's not Zlati yet. Zlati, Zlati, sorry. Zlati, let me my This thing, this is a C. Yeah, there's, yeah, sorry. That, this is a dollar sign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is S. Just remember about dollar. Yep. This thing. Uh, the last thing. Good, good job. And I believe it finished in the right mood. Yeah, thanks. It finished in the right mood. You know. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Connor. Okay. Sorry, it's very detailed work and probably it doesn't look very, you know, appreciated and so, so active, but 
but you know, it's very important at a very good base for your entire work on the Russian. Sure. Good for you. Thank Perfect. You so much. Thanks very much. Thank you. Bye. Okay, sorry, because the hour is longer, and I had to to do a lot of stuff and pay a lot of attention for this uh, podcast. Okay, Ciao, maestro. the next is uh, Kathleen. Yes, hello. Yeah, great to see you again, great to see you again. So, uh, we'll keep working. would like to work uh, again with the Harvest of Soft, yeah? Yeah, yeah, Ushti Niva Maya. Yeah, but Harvest of Soft is very strange translation. Very I know. English. <laughs> uh, let me let me find just just script. Sure, absolutely. Maestro Rosetta. Yes, I'm here. Okay, uh, listen. I would love you to have here to work so long, but uh, we finish at I midnight. <laughs> I remember. Just a I little remember. bit. Okay. But, but the reason is that we didn't book for our last year. Yeah, it's true. Day. And now we are working again, so it will be much, much uh, more effective. And sure. Thank you. I promise. Ciao. I promise. It's okay. I just have to remember what you yes. told me last yeah, time and do it. You remember again what you have been talking about, yeah? It's, yeah, yeah. Uh, more loose language, a little lazier with the language, but not too lazy. Yes, yeah. the measure, the measure, but yeah. don't be probably so insistent. Okay. And, and we have to remember that this is art song, it's not opera. Right. And this is a difference in pronunciation in opera mm -hmm. and art songs. It's like a uh, the difference in German, for instance, when you are singing Wagner and when you are singing uh, earlier music, Schubert. Singing, so it's not such a such a strong delivery. Okay. Ah. Mm -hmm. Let's start here. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Thank you. Okay. Good. Yeah. Uh, uh, technically, as far as I can hear, but I should say that this time is much, much, much better. Oh, cool. Uh, uh, you know, it's much, much, much more helpful to do than the, the first one. Oh, uh, but uh, pay attention for the pitch uh, of the last page. Oh. Because it's very high tessitura. See. Really very high. And, uh, you know, your breast control, your larynx position, you know, it's getting a little too high. I see. Okay. And you got some sharp, sharp pitch. Okay. And uh, listen, this is a lot of legato. Okay. This is a little bit wide. This is like because it's a folk style. Yeah. As we, as we talked before, and folk, uh, folk uh, dialect. Mm. So it's a little bit, it's a little bit like crying. Yeah. So don't hesitate to do that. Okay. But, but because of this high tessitura, you're getting higher, 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 and higher. And you have to find some places just to to relax. Okay. You can pause before starting the new line. Okay. Just the pay attention for that. Okay. Uh, and uh, uh, you you have corrected, you have fixed. Uh, Many mistakes in the pronunciation, okay. uh, but very, in the way that is good, a good, great job, great job. And uh, in the first phrase, please be more precise. Ushtiniva. Niva. This is clear E and soft N. Soft N, okay. Yeah, yeah. because you know, we have two different consonants okay. color, color, two different colors of mm -hmm. consonants. We have uh, uh, more uh, closing mm -hmm. and uh, and more soft. Mm. And so, so, so the uh, before uh, before O and I, it sounds more closing, more strong, like no, no, notch, notch, not not notch. But when we have A E E, the consonant ends. Uh, becomes softer. I. Ni, niva, niva, and the same It's yes. a little bit different disposition of the tongue mm -hmm. than just the, the forward part of the tongue. So it doesn't mean back or something wrong. No, it, it's it's helpful. Okay. So, u, u stay, it should be u, mm -hmm. u, like a kiss. Again, u, stay, niva, maya, niushka. This is a, a soft, uh, the soft suffix, and uh, it was very good. Mahalitinava, and then it was unclear. It wasn't clear. Tibia. Like the first time you changed, you changed the word. Nies yazat tibia. Could you just speak up to me? So nies vazat. 
не связать тебе диви сноп су 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 вы диви сноп е диви диви сноп ва ва диви сноп ва е диви сноп сноп So it is quite complicated, yeah. <laughs> but I would like to demonstrate a wonderful addition that will be very helpful. Okay. Uh, I repeat it, not because I don't have anything to tell you <laughs> more, but it's just because we have a broad, broadcast in, in YouTube and it's extremely helpful for the correct pronunciation. Okay. And this brochure includes all even very soft, very small details of Russian pronunciation. Oh, great. That I appreciate so much. Okay. So thank you for the author of this book. Thank you. So, I miss you that, you know, uh, uh, if you would like to be correct with ones, yeah. you have to remember about the previous concept. For instance, не. That means no. Right, нет. Не, не. It's a very soft N. Нет. Не. No any E, no any shadow of E. Just soft N and A. Не. 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 Like a little bit capricious baby. Не. 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 Yes. Yeah. Two. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. We're just looking <laughs> for the correct way. So, yeah. so supported by pretty, pretty, pretty on. Okay. Yeah. 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 Right. Oh. Right. Cool. Sometimes look. Sometimes the confidence helps, even if you don't have the correct idea about how to pronounce the word in any language. When we are confident, self-confident, it works out. Okay. Good. Then, Wrong but confident. That's right. Uh, that. uh, raza. Uh, raza spliech dalo. Oh, riazm spliech. Oh. Raza spliech dalo. Could you repeat this phrase? Okay. So, uh, ne strach not. Uh, razm spliech daloi. Ne strach. This is very complicated, but yeah. also just think, just think about soft. Soft concepts. Не стря, стря. Soft it means you are using you are using the forward part of your tongue. Oh, okay. The uh, tip of your tongue. It's not getting back because when we use the middle part and back part of our tongue, uh, the consonants are getting you know uh, caught. Yeah, not so soft. It's like in this situation, it's like. Uh, imitate uh, baby where you're talking with baby trying to imitate you. Okay. this kind of behavior in yeah. this position. So, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, was, 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 this is this is the word. Was, 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 Razum splitch the loy. Yeah. Okay. Uh, in the word splitch, uh, to make it uh, to make it correctly, just think about soft L. Splitch. 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 And never run, never run away from 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 your rivers. You know, don't don't be shy. Okay. Splitch. Splitch. Just pronounce like you, like, like you, you, you was born Russian. Pronounce it like you are sure that you are Russian. Splitch. Just do it again. Splitch. Не стряхнуть вас разом, сплетч дал. Oh, God. Okay. Не, uh... <laughs> You know, my, my wonderful cousin, Olga Pelletyakta, okay. who is a permanent uh, artist of uh, Rossini Opera Festival, okay. now she's, uh, uh, she's doing the, the CD of uh, different nations' uh, lullabies. Oh, so cute. 
And she has a fantastic uh, ears and pitch. For, for, in, for instance, Chinese, uh, they think that it's something Chinese, somebody Chinese. Mm. Chinese, Japanese, Russian, Italian, French, uh, American, yeah. everything. Okay. So, and, and she's very confidently. Oh, it yeah, helps. it does. It helps. Yeah, you believe yeah, her because <laughs> she's so yeah, confident. You have to accept it. You yeah. have to accept it for a while, for this uh, 15, 20 minutes, that you are Russian. Okay. Yeah. Then. Well, because if you do apologize to this, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm wrong, I'm blah, 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 blah. I just look slightly tried. It, it doesn't help. Because it's all your confidence, mm. despite it's complicated. Okay. It's not like pleasure. It's Spleč. pleasure, for instance, you see the difference in the consonant of pleasure because the middle of your tongue works. Right. Pleasure. Pleasure. And it's just just a, a tip. A pleach. Pleach. Glitch. Right. Okay. Perfect. 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 Then just to let me so that it's also complicated. Uh, it's even complicated for us. Just don't worry. Okay, good. It <laughs> makes me feel better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh was ni vis kazat. Uh Maybe? Uh, v, v should be a little bit softer. So the V is more shorter. V is right. right. You got it. You got this idea. Yeah. yeah. Of course, the, uh, each language, this is a different combination of artic uh, articulating uh, instruments. Right. So uh, for the first few, Russian looks like a little deeper. Deeper mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's not always like that. It's not always like that. It's much more Italian. -y okay, than so I then it was one by one. Thank you. Uh, just be careful with the different parts of any piece. Okay. You know, especially when it's a little bit uh, monotone, it's not good for it for one. <laughs> <laughs> but in the same mood, I would say. It's yeah. In the same mood. Vibe. We have to find out. Uh, the difference in the in the in these parts. Okay. So when you get Yeah. When when the, the section of tempo. Oh okay. But you see the difference in the piano accompaniment. Yeah. Pianissimo and forte. And you have, it's a little bit getting despite the the pianist in uh, her piano. You have a forte here. Mm -hmm. So probably put a little bit more energy here, and will uh, it will make uh, this part a little bit more fun. And then again, three piano. Okay. And then Shirako Rizumi Parasipolis. Parasipolis. Yes. It's a wild. Uh, uh, you my thoughts mm -hmm. are scattered far and wide. Yeah. And so you have to find this a little bit wide line in your voice. Understand what I mean? See. Yep. So just for one page, mm -hmm. there are three different colors. Mm -hmm. uh, and for me, it was not so. Be careful with the pitch here. Yeah, I went sharp. Right. And yeah, despite uh, this is the TC tour is still so high, mm -hmm. try to keep the kind of big canto sound. Okay. When you are singing the, for instance, I don't know, Maria Joana, the first time. Yeah. Yeah. Try, okay. to, try to interplay this kind of sensation okay. in, this, in this piece. Okay. So that it shouldn't be pushed, it shouldn't be tensed, okay. it shouldn't be uh, squeezed, mm -mm. because otherwise it sounds a little squeezed. Okay. Uh, and could you repeat, Kams Kadila, Luther the Child Kaba. Uh, Kalpaj. Hams Khadila. They rose up the cruel grass of the seven. Oh. Hams Khadila. 
Tamsvadila Lyuta Pichatrava. Trava. Trava. Pichal, this is soft L. Pichal. Pichal Trava. Pichal. Right. Pichal Trava. Pichal yes. Trava. When you use when you use the proverb part of your tongue, it immediately the, the pronunciation, you know, in use of the right words. It's very really interesting. Probably we didn't think about that before. Uh, this is very complicated combination of four consonants. <laughs> this next but part of it. It's crazy, not just you. I cannot imagine how how it's possible to to see bread. Thumbs ha. Thumbs ha. Thumbs ha di uh thumbs ha thumbs. Yes. Right, right, right. Yeah. Right. Yes. Thumbs ha. Thumbs ha. No. Thumb. B C H M B C H. Thumbs it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be uh, exaggerated. Okay. Thumbs ha. Thumbs ha dila. Thumbs ha dila. Thumbs ha dila luta pichal trava. Thumbs ha dila luta pichal trava. Pichal so please. Pichal trava. Pichal trava. And they are group up. Grew up scaling music. <laughs> uh, the last word. Yeah, Viras. Viras Tala Gore Galuchi. Gore. Ah, Viras. Viras Tala. Viras Tala. Not V. This is this is not so soft. Okay. V. 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 Uh, v. 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 Viras Tala. Viras Tala. Right. Absolutely right. Keep it. Put it in your computer, please. Forever. Deal. Virastala Gure Garuchi. Oh God. Virastala Gure Roche. Yeah? Gore. 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 Sorrow. Gore. Gore. And, and another word, Garuchi. Garuchi. Garu. 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 Gariuchi. Gariuchi. Right. Ah. Oops. 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 Perfect. So if you don't mind, yeah. we, uh, we complete our work trying to sing the last sections. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that starts in Shirako Vedume Parasipali. Parasipali. Kudapala. Kudapala. So Chirako from there. И там сходила люта печаль трава, вырастала горе горючее. Okay. Like it sounds for me like very antique poetry. Okay. Antique, antique folk poetry, like Homer. Okay. For for uh, for Greeks, it, it, it sounds a little bit in this very high but folk style. Okay. Do you, okay. Do you want to do you want to go? Okay. So uh, chi, the chiro. Not she, not she, not she, but she. She. Like some Shiraz. Shiraz. Oh, yeah. It's, it's like Shiraz. Like the one. Shiraz. Got it. Now I know. Yeah. So, the Shiraz go? Yeah. Thank you. I, I need some Shiraz for my whole life. Me too. Great. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 
You have to help her. You have to help her be the last nail because it's con more. So con a little bit more firm because otherwise it's very exhausting and long line. Okay. It was much better. Thank you. Better. <laughs> Except for that but, one but, moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's really, it's extremely demanding. Yeah. It's extremely high demand. Yeah. Uh, just pay attention for your passage. Yeah. Air. Zone of passage. Yeah. G F E. G F E. G -F -E. Okay. Because of a, a little bit, a little bit not correct coordination. Yeah, I see. Your legs, it, 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 it drops out. Yeah. You know, and this stuff. Okay. So just just try to probably to use these logs or something like that to relax your root of your tongue and to uh, to think about the combination of space inside, you know, probably it's too much or too less. Now it we, uh, we don't have a chance to work on that because it's just not working. <laughs> okay? Okay. But but try to figure out what you can say. And yes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for your extremely hard work. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. What's the next? You got the Yeah, yeah. Okay, perfect. Hi, Maestro. Uh, I have a Tobuila Ranya Yubeshnoi, which is okay. one of the Tchaikovsky romances. In just a moment, I have to get my scores. Also, another another volume, okay. and I highly recommend you for foreigners who would like to sing Russian art songs to use it. It's very helpful. <laughs> okay, guys. Oh, moments. Mm -hmm. uh, I, uh, I would like to remind you that Tchaikovsky uh, wrote this art song when he was 30, just 30. Yeah. 
and it's very interesting uh, uh, color of uh, his creative, creativity mm -hmm. you know, because mm -hmm. uh, the life of Tchaikovsky was not so easy, you know. Yeah. Uh, but it, it, in the same time, it, it was not so hard. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, it's it's an extremely curious set of circumstances, events, uh, his thoughts, his moods. Uh, because you know, uh, he was uh, he became very famous, mm. and he was accepted very well by the audience in and the court and the, uh, no, not colors, of course, you know. Mm -hmm. it, it doesn't happen with colors so, so often, you know. But anyway, he was really very extremely famous person mm -hmm. uh, uh, when he was alive. He, for his time, it was like uh, Andrew Lloyd Webber, for mm -hmm. In the same time, he was he had big problems with his private life. His, his mom died uh, like him. You know, this is like an arc, arc, arc mm -hmm. of his life. His mother died in front of his eyes because of how it's, how it's called in English, or the title of this sickness, you know, cholera. Cholera. Cholera, yeah. yeah. And uh, he was very connected with his mother. Mm -hmm. And it's so strange that she died because of the same sickness. Not so even even for 19th century, it was not so. It happened not so often. Mm -hmm. But it's the kind of story, the kind of a knowing of the life, but the, not not artificial, real life, mm -hmm. not a fiction, not a fiction, real life. It's so such an interesting idea, you know. And. Uh, this uh, here is a very important word, like a like a key, like a key for all his uh, uh, pieces, for all his uh, art songs and operas. Viva, it means it was. Mm -hmm. It was in the early spring. It was. Even he was just 30, 31. And it repeats in his art song permanently because he always had the master gene yeah. about something. And the, the purest, the purest thing that probably this something never happened. So it's like a hunt mm -hmm. It's like, like just a deal or something, something extremely uh, uh, beautiful, uh, you know, profound, important happened in his life. Some meetings, some love affairs some connections, you know. But I believe the most of them didn't happen in the, in the end. Mm -hmm. So it makes a very special color of uh, each stuff. That in. This is a rhythm that, despite Tchaikovsky, is pretty young uh, at the moment. Very young people, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't fit. Mm -hmm. The thing, you know, Tchaikovsky and songs doesn't fit for, for young kids. Okay. Yeah, when you will teach uh, sometime, you know, many years later. But just remember that. Never try, don't do it, the uh, Chikovsky songs for the beginning. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. sometimes it's used in Russia. No, not just because it's difficult. What is sometimes it's difficult, sometimes not. It's just because it needs a lot of uh, life experience. So, and please uh, be attentive for these words. It was, it was, it was another spring. It was when I loved, it was when I was in love, it was when I had somebody in front of me and uh, she, she was so beautiful and uh, I was crying, you know. And it's about, it, it's quite simple. Mm. And, uh, about some uh, pronunciation and at the same time technical approaches and, and, uh, and problems. Mm -hmm. You have to remember that I don't know why, but in this text, in this poetry, there are so many close A. Okay. Close A. Listen. Tobila Ranyeyu. Ranyeyu. Is closed. 
Okay. Jedva, pravat jedva sredja. It's very clean, it's pure. I have to, I have to make a look how it's more. I have a second. Okay, for you. Uh, uh, Ruchni tekli. Tekli. It seems to know why all my hair. They all be happy. They have be happy. Tekli. Nie. Nie. Nie parilsno. Nie parilsno. O žizni. Ok. Zelen. 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 And this, uh, this last end is mm. very strong. Zelen. So, it's interesting. I never, I never thought about that so much. That, that the most of words here are pronounced on the soft way. Mm -hmm. Soft way. So, very poor, but very, very delicate tip of your tongue. Okay. So, Izelin uh, Rostrazin. But uh, it was not clear at all. Okay. Uh, look at this sandwich. Truba pastusia poutru ishenipela zonka. Could you repeat this phrase after me? Truba pastusia poutru ishenipela zonka. Bravo. It's almost very clean. But in singing, you know, you lost something. Okay. You can. U zadivkah je šo, je šo barovu paparinu. To bi varan bi bil znoj, je repetit sem words, and je repetit the same next steps. So, let's move on. Can you find kada so lip, ka je predan mor? Когда с улыбкой предан мной? Мной, 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 the Ochi Apostina, it's not Ochi. The Ochi, yeah. It's the same, Tona Lyubov Mayova, Atviet, 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 it's also close. The Apostila Vyezh. The Apostila Vyezh. And remember the combination of strong and weak syllables is very important for any language. And it's very easy because you know Tchaikovsky in some sense is traditional composer, mm -hmm. and he, he he didn't show in the, the structure of the of the, of the, of the language. Mm -hmm. So if you are uh, in in doubt about either strong or or, or weak syllable, so you can see is it the first beat on the bar you know, that is just strong. So and 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 use a little bit of a project. Okay. So the apostilla, yeah, yeah. This is two eight notes, but anyway, they are different. They're different. O žiži, o les, no j. Okay. O les. No j. Okay. Just soft l and a. Close there. Less. Less. It's like it's like English less. Less, yeah, less. Less, no, no less. Less. L less. More or less. Less. More or less. 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 For some sense, soft V and close A. Sire. Sire. Just Siet. forward part of the articulation instrument. Sire. O unest o na diezdi. O na diezdi. Na diezdi. No i. No, just soft D, Nag soft D and A, Nag not D and G. Not D and G. Yeah, yeah. Uh, please uh, be in love with the key of your okay. tongue. Not D and G. Not D and G. Not D and G. Now it's a little bit more close. Not D and G. D 
değişti. Not this. G, just D. Just D. Not this. No, nothing else. Not this. Not this. You know, it's very interesting because not this. It means the hope, the spirit. This is a, it's like an Italian. Also, this is the female uh, name. Mm -hmm. And the, the the lady who was a philanthrop for Jacobs, her name was not this. <laughs> So you you have to pay attention for this. Thing. Yeah, I have to definitely get that one right then. Pronounce it correctly. One idea. Uh, okay, iplak. 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 These two syllables are not the same okay. in language. In the language. So it's also a Japanese. And guys, I think it's very important in all languages to be very correct with the uh, strong. Uh, uh, strong uh, syllables, strong and weak syllables. And remember, the strong syllables are always slightly uh, longer, and uh, weak syllables are a little bit lighter, lighter degree of articulation. Mm -hmm. So it's a, it's a, probably almost the same length, but it's like the movement forward and then the movement back. Okay. It's completely the same distance, but it's a little different energy. So it helps. Not the edge. Not the not the edge. The not, not just don't don't shake it. Okay. It's just just very 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 you know and the gap of movement. Not the edge. Not the edge. The. So it looks like like a projector. Mm -hmm. It looks like a leaning calibre, leaning on something. It will help you with your project, with your phrase. Yeah. Uh, Sorry. This is a great key for Russian communication. You see, I'm like, I, I look like very stupid, crazy man who is repeating the same stuff. Two hours. Oh my gosh, but it helps. Yep. So we were running there. Vesnoi. Vesnoi. Yes, right? Tini, Viros, no barrier. Viros. Very delicate, soft consonant and Be very delicate, close. Viros. Viros. Bird, bird, bird. So we were ultra nice. I didn't get it. I, did, I didn't get it. Uh, what did you see here? Could you read, could you just speak? To bila utra naših lijet. To bila utra naših lijet. Oops. No. Okay. To bila. To bila. Bila. It was, it was the, the morning of our lijet. Just expression. To bila utra naših lijet. Utra naših lijet. Naših lijet. Lijet gleost. Nasi Shasti. You can double first, uh, first fricative consonant. Shasti. Shasti. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and remember, it's also soft. It's not shasti, it's a sh. Shasti. Shasti. Right. Confidently, confident, confident. Shasti. Shasti. Right. It's really interesting. It happens. It, 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 it happens much, much better when you when you really just feel something. Okay. Confident. Yeah. Shut. 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 Yeah. Yes, right. Or slow. Or slow is we. Uh, oh. Oh no. Slow z. Slow z. Slow z. Slow z. Or less. Or less. Yeah. Yes, yes. Or less. 
Ou Gizne. Ou Sonsa Svet. 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 Oops. Sorry, guys, something happened to you there. The, the Oops. Oh, yeah, yeah, can you hear me? yeah I can see you now. It's yeah. all better. Yeah. Fine, fine. Let's continue. Uh, you mentioned, oh, 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 yes, oh, no, songs are sweet, 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 the same idea. Sweet. Yes, right. Mm. Oh, sweet. Sveži duh beriozi. Duh beriozi. Yeah, right. So in this in this art song, you have to use more soft consonant before a and more close a after the soft consonant. Okay. It's not so complicated. Okay. Uh, uh, we are a little bit limited on time, so yep. I will offer. I will offer. Uh, let's start from To na ljubov moju v tvet, te opustila vežde. Okay. Could we start from here? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, to na, so it's bar 43. Ah, oh, okay, yeah, correct. A few forte, means a forte. Good. I will play one bar before. Okay. Ton alone of my old heart, the apusti of the Don't don't put your here. Okay. Just soft L and A. Glad. Glad. No any E vowel. No any E vowel. Glad. Glad. It's important. Glad. Yes. And also D softer. Glad. 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 Okay. Yes. Uh, okay. To be a ultra nasty fear. Let's start from there. Okay. Bar 67. Uh, to be a ultra. I yeah, it's. Ultra. Uh, no, it's. Um, to, to be a ultra nasty fear. It's bar 73. Or it is 73. Okay. Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. 73. Yeah. <laughs> To byla utra naši svět, o šťastě, o šlozu i o... Stop, stop, stop. Rite tento, adli tuton, don't rush. And it's very important where we have the 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 stressil, o šťastě, o šťastě, o šlozu, o šlozu i... Slozy, slozy, and and uh, like like uh, a little bit more narrow schwa. Slozy, 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 s s not slozy, slozy, slozy. Oh, shut it! But look, it's very important. Oh, happiness. Yeah. Oh, tears. Oh, forest. Oh, life. 
or sunlight and uh, the fresh fresh spirit of uh, 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 nature trees. Mm -hmm. So it's a set explanation. It's very important. So you have to shape each of that. Or just, it's like, uh, mm -hmm. or mar, or chair. Understand? Yes, you? understand. With the same expression, and you you can double a little bit the first one, a little bit. Okay. Or just, or slow, or less, or trees, or songs of the air. And then, wait a little last part. Okay. Okay? Could we play again the climax? Okay. So, not a little bit of trash. Tabu, you are full of trash. Tabu, you are full of trash. Tabu, you are full of trash. Tabu, you are so, do you understand? Do you understand what I would like to tell you? Yes. To hear and see. Yeah. yeah. And and please, in, in, uh, when you are uh, doing that, don't be so shy. Okay. To support the voice. Yeah. So it's it's really very complicated to work online on this uh, technical details, technical yeah. components and aspects of your scene. Yeah. But be careful with the top register. Yes. If the if the top register is not so spontaneous, not so easy, mm -hmm. it is never go back. Okay. But you have a tendency to go back. Yeah. And it, yeah, I, I'm a little bit concerned about that. Okay. And and see if you have some exclamation, if you have some uh, some appreciate singing, it doesn't mean that they have to just to stop to support to keep the light in general to sing. Yeah. Sing, keeping the same correct expression of uh, your uh, pronunciation and interpretation. Okay. Okay. But I like your choice. I believe it fits you very well. Thank you. It fits you very well. Yeah, no, I really, I, I really like this set. I think it's really beautiful. Yeah, and also it's a pleasure uh, to be together, to 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 make a music together yeah. with the pianist. Yeah. You know, because sometimes you know it's very different. Yeah. You know, and that the, the, the singing line is too far from uh, what the pianist is doing. You know, it's so together. It's such a complete picture. Mm. So and, and 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 you have to feel all details, all intentions, all turns of your partner and the pianist. Yeah. And the same for the pianist. Yeah. And and please remember, this is a measure. This is a combination of uh, freedom and rubato, mm -hmm. and what's uh, written in the scores written. Yeah. And the question of measure. This is very important for Tchaikovsky, otherwise it would be or too dry, yep. either too sentimental. Okay. And the center. Yes. Yeah, make it so. Yes. Okay. Lovely. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Maestro. Thank you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hi. Yeah, yeah. I love uh, everything, yeah. Great. With the, with the yeah, introduction. Of, Great. It's Remain Remain. Yeah. Okay. Hi, Dimitri. Hi. Hi. I'm David. I'm singing Gremmins Aria. Gremmins. Yeah. yeah. Okay, David. Great. Bridget, just let, give me a moment to score this. So, did you find two bars before? We did, we did. Great. So, beautiful note, a beautiful cello line. Yeah. Before you start the other. Yeah. Любви вся 
Sounds a little like it is German music. Okay. The German music. You know, so when we are preparing, when we are cooking a wonderful soup uh, of our singing, we have to put uh, a wonderful uh, Italian uh, clarity of vowels and brightness of the of the tone uh, and uh, in perfect German German pronunciation and importance of words and consonants and uh, uh, beautiful lines, sometimes beautiful color of Russian singing or Czech singing. Understand what I mean? Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, so it, it, these proportions should be very correct. So now let's come back. Let's let's turn a little bit more on the side of Italian sound. Okay. Italian sound. And if you look, it's a typical Italian uh, romantic accompaniment. So nothing to extremely very, uh, very full of sound or tutti of the orchestra, you know. Mm -hmm. Just support it, just support it for your beautiful life. Okay. And we have to manage it. So, uh, first of all, be careful with the. Uh, then no, you are making some very Russian mistakes. Like some Russians are doing that. For instance, pakuan, pakuan. It mm. means that your long jaw moves too much. Okay. During the during the walk, understand it? Mm -hmm. So instead of pakorni, we get pakuan. That's not good. That's okay. Not good. Russian vowels are not so. Uh, uh, clean, clear, like Italian, mm -hmm. uh, like Italian, but anyway, it's it's too much of diphthong sound. Okay. So, and uh, uh, in, in your case, I would offer a little bit slower tempo, a little bit slower tempo, and a little more distance between the first, uh, the, the first accord, the left hand. And the second one on the right hand. So to calm down a little bit. So otherwise he's getting a little bit too rush. Okay. Mm, pa, um, pa. So this kind of movement. And the seventh, like like a metronome, like a like a like a watch. Yeah, okay. Because anyway, he is not young. He's not so old. No. Otherwise, he's not so so passionate with his work. <laughs> it wouldn't be past him. But his middle age for the period of time. Yeah. So there are some discussions about his age, but I believe he's under 40s. Okay. Under 40s, no more. But anyway, for this period, for, for this time, it was uh, quite experienced man. Mm -hmm. So I don't know, he knows life. And we can see it in the economy. He knows what life is and think with that. Okay. So he he's he's talking to uh, Anigan as a wise man, mm -hmm. wise man who was a who was a warrior, uh, you know, who had to some he, he was uh, I guess I forgot the word. Uh, um, he did many um he got some strike yeah uh, many awards many uh, 
distinctions. Yes, yeah, 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 and also that. Okay. Uh, so try to be wise and uh, be in love together. It's not easy. Okay. But usually, for common, for common, it's not easy. But you have to do that. Okay. No any rush. No any rush. Let's try it. written by Tchaikovsky, noble, with nobles, uh, tranquilo, mm -hmm. but very warm, yeah. very warm. So I, I, didn't, I didn't make a look on that before we talked about that. It's completely, you know, accords mm -hmm. what, he, what he wrote. Mm -hmm. uh, that's right. Любви все возрасты покорны. Please avoid such strong movements by low job. So it sounds a little too sarcastic. Like a little bit like a sarcastic, like sarcastic or like a like a kind of pen. Okay. No, no, very you mean it. You mean it. Mm. Okay. Again. Rusty Parkwardy. This is a problem of communication, mm -hmm. but I hear that the vibrato is getting faster, and I don't like it. Okay, it's like an Italian cantilena should be absolutely equal vibrato mm -hmm. in the all uh, in, uh, all over in the range, mm -hmm. uh, and then uh, pronunciation. Last you have to be. Guys, with this consonant. Okay. Ras Rast S T soft T Rast And then Rast Could you repeat just and speak it? Slowly and, and precisely. Vrast Yeah, it's better, but don't rush. Rast Vrast yeah, so E after V doesn't exist. It's not E here. Uh, you, you pronounce Rast Tviet. Yes, okay. I do Rast Tviet, just soft V. Mm. V come back for the same problem, you see. Okay. Soft V and, uh, and the close F, Rast Tviet. Vrast Svetje Viet. Is that it? Vrast Svetje. And uh, the strong syllable Viet. And you have to construct the word, the phrase, mm. like, like that. Vrast Svetje yeah. Viet. Vrast Svetje. Vrast Svetje. No, A, A is close. A is close. It's not Vrast Svetje. Yeah. Vrast Svetje. Yeah. Yes, because this combination is very general. Mm -hmm. It's very general, as we talked before about that. Okay. And I have so many words, so mm -hmm. many constants. But you have to, to come through. You okay. have to be. 
Could you repeat again this phrase? Just to sing it. Singing. singing, yep. Singing again. This one. Yeah. I played the song from a bar before. Okay. E, e flat uh, with a syllable CDA, it should be longer. Mm -hmm. This is eight and count. Mm -hmm. But uh, you shouldn't okay. Please do that because it's a very important uh, melody in this phrase. Mm -hmm. It's a climax of this phrase. You want to show us the again? Once more? Yeah, please. <laughs> Then you make a small mistake in the word Sedorio. No, no, it's not Siedo. Siedo, soft S. Sedoyo. Sedoyo. Double S. Double S. Sedoyo. Sedoyo. Galavoy. And this is this is just C flat. Galavoy. It's just C flat. But anyway, you have to 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 make your note more round. Because it's a very romantic fading. Mm -hmm. When it's so open, it sounds a little bit. Mm, how I can say it? How I can say it? Not so now. Okay, fair. Not That's... so now. Yeah. Think about me. Okay. Think about me. The very long Start to think about uh diminuendo before you start it Just to think about it. You have to do the end. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is a calor no sul boy. Yeah. Is a calor. Stretch. Yes, right. Okay, stop, stop, stop. It's very important because Anika, this is the title of the opera. Mm -hmm. The same, the same idea. Soft M, close A, no any shadow of E vowel. Okay. So on Yegen, on Yegen, sometimes we are we are teasing foreigners with this kind of pronunciation. You know, mm -hmm. each of uh, each of you know nationality have this kind of jokes. Okay. So on Yegen, yet you uh, with uh, you, it's it's not correct pronunciation. Don't exaggerate with this E vowel. So, okay. Okay. Anyegin. Just soft and echoes. Anyegin. Anyegin. Right. Bravo. Okay. In some sense, we always have to be more simple in our pronunciation to find out the, the easiest way how to do that. Yeah. Okay. And don't, don't make it more heavy. The summary. Yes. Okay. 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 Okay.
do believe this is the most important word in Russian vocabulary. Yeah. It means I love you. Excuse me. Probably mm -hmm. you don't do you don't need to use this word okay. when you come to, to Russia. <laughs> so this no first of all, this is the same well in the in the both uh circles. So the new, the last new, was absolutely correct. But the first one was unclear. Okay. Could you repeat? Lou blue. Lou like blue. Two kisses. Lou blue. Two kisses. Lou blue. Yes, what? Um, yes, oh my God, you know that you are. Yeah, the other one. Yeah, this one. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry that I take. Sorry that I ask you to take very short phrases, but we are sorry to some time, so we have to move on. Understand? That's okay. That's okay. So, yeah. Yep. Yes, Lord. Oh, I'm doing it. Hold on. And it's, it's not the yes. It's not the yes. Okay. No e. So the and close the this this. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And and this is sixteen. Remember that. Yes. Yes. Na ya lubiu Tatiana. Tashkliva shis ma ya tekla. Ana ya vila si zashkla. Akzul stalft. Sledinia niastia, nieshis, imola dast, tamola dast, isha. It's very interesting because uh, in the original, this is another word. Oh, okay. And but we in in the in the middle of uh, uh, 20th century, we had to change the word because you know it was trying for another sense, not such a sweet. Hmm. So in original, it should be Anayadilas Idala. So it means she appeared and gave it. Mm -hmm. And you can imagine how it would sound in Russian. Yes. So, uh, so you know, they changed the, 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 the word. But keep keep the movement here. Go forward for this uh, uh, D flat. Okay. <laughs> Ah, so, um, yeah. Songs, not Ah, yeah. It's like sun. Yeah. Songs it means sun. Yeah. Very similar in some sense. Как солнце лучше среди ненастия, но не жизнь. And then it's very important. Молодость. Youth. Yeah. This L, because it's not before E or E, it's before O. This L not, it's not so soft. So it's not more lodos, it's more lodos. So we start to use a little bit uh, more the middle part of the tongue. Okay. More lodos. More, more lodos. So it sounds even more like ah. More lodos. Okay. More lodos. But more lodos. More lodos. The strong syllable is the first one, and mm -hmm. you can you can check it because it's the first uh, uh, the first beat in the book. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is it clear? Make sense? Yeah. It's important. Because she gave him youth. Yeah. And this is of set, this is the sense of this area. Mm -hmm. She appeared and gave him youth. Mm -hmm. So remember that. Mm -hmm. This combination of age and being young. Yeah. Uh maladies, maladies be shut. Uh, let's start with Mnie uh, Jizi. Espresso. Yes, Mnie Jizi. Okay. No, 
going off from there for a few bars later. Just left yeah, you yeah. where we about yeah. oh, six okay. bars. Yeah, yeah. yeah that one. Yes. Yes. Be faster. Very. Mm -hmm. A little bit uh, faster is not correct for uh, 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 more movement. Okay. Inner movement. <laughs> You know, among all these bad people that I was around, yeah, I she is mm -hmm. she's the only she's the only honest and lovely person. Mm -hmm. You know, this is a okay. Mm -hmm. And you see this syncope. This syncope it means that he is he is nervous. He's it, it's some nerve in this in this life. Okay. In this Let's try again. Okay. Frozen. Okay. Sorry, I lost you in that... the uh, closer to, to the end of this uh, session. That's okay. Do you hear me? Yeah, I hear you now. Can you hear us? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Guys, do you hear me? Yeah, yeah. we can hear you. Can you hear us? What is she doing? Hmm. Can you? Hello? Testing? Two to two, two. <clears throat> Didn't like how I sang it earlier, so it's great. Uh, uh, hello? Okay, do you hear me, guys? Yeah, can you hear yeah, us? I'm sorry, but sometimes something was wrong with the light. Uh, that's why I didn't hear the end of this section, but it's very important all this, uh, uh, all this. Uh, Ends of the word via the consonant. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of that. There are a lot of that. Especially in the second. And you should you shouldn't pronounce it on a very German way. Okay. This is much much more gentle, much 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 softer than you do. Okay. So for instance, it's just slightly order. Okay. So you shouldn't. You shouldn't push it to support this hard too much. Could you just start this? Did you look at it? Yeah. Push it? You want to support everything? Yes, sir. Let's go. 
Ah, thank you. Hopefully. Thank you. Thank, thank you very much. Hi. Hi. I'm Gianni. You are? Yeah, I'm Gianni. I'm the, the only Italian. I'm the exchange with uh, Rossini Opera Festival Academy. Oh, great, great. Yeah. And uh, to, to be Italian, you have to remember how great Ettore Castellini is on this side. Yeah. Ettore Castellini did it, did it. Oh. And also, it was a very interesting performance of Pig Day at La Scala at the beginning of the 60s uh, with a great uh, La Turca. Uh, and uh, say oh. Uh, oh. So and this uh, this recording exists. This recording exists. in these days. Remember the Mazzini. Huh? So we have a long tradition how to sing in Italian. Uh, Gianna, Luigi. I don't. Oops. Yeah, frozen. Do you hear me? Oh, yeah. 
I'm so sorry. I guess that uh, uh, I'm working with you from the hotel. And now it's evening time. And uh, yeah. the net is overweight. Exactly. So, yeah. But anyway, let's try. So did you hear about uh, some Italians or uh, quasi-Italian singers who did a lot of uh, big dance? Like Leno Gencia, Antonio Bastianini, Sesto Boscantini, and be, and I believe this area has to have a beautiful Italian legato cantabile. Uh, that this uh, quite complicated Russian text shouldn't shouldn't bother. Yeah. So let's try. Yeah. Yeah. Let's try. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Was lo blo, lo blo bez mierna, bez vas ne mislio nja praži. Ja blo vik svi bez primjerna, na to vsi čo. Oh, 
сейчас я возвращусь. О, милая, Thank you, John. Uh, I have to say that you have. You hear me? Yep. Yeah. Uh, I have to say that you have everything to for singing this area beautifully. You have everything. What do we need for this area? Uh, we need, first of all, a beautiful timber of You have it. The second point, we have to we have to have a full range. This is the reason that uh, this area is so effective for any competition or and any audition. Because after this area, you can you can have the the, the full uh, imagination about lyric very tongue voice. Stop, it's uh, bottom, it's middle register. The third point you have to have a fantastic legato cantabile. Uh, in your singing. Uh, it, everything would be wonderful if uh, there wouldn't be so many consonants and words that makes a problem for uh, for foreigners and understand. Yeah. Uh, in the, uh, I would offer you, when, when maybe you will be alone and you will get this course, to sing in firstly in Italian. Okay. In Italian uh, uh, translation. How these great baritones did it, you know, in the uh, 20th century. Okay. So it should help you because I I hear that you are musical and uh, you have a wonderful, a great job, and very good intentions, but you are concentrated so much on the pronunciation, of course, because you know you have uh, of course. Of course. for for uh, Russian speaker. Uh, uh, it will help you to feel the shape of the whole area. The, the, this 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 passage, this movement, this poet, and sometimes with the sex. Uh, the most important phrases of this area, of course, yeah. Yeah, was, you know, all of us have to know what does it mean. Yeah. You know, I love you. And then it's very important phrase. Uh, I would like to be just your friend. Okay. I would like okay. to be just your friend. Uh, last year, in the last edition of the Salzburg Festival, you know, it was a big day, the production of big day, and uh, we can agree, we can disagree with the same direction, but I like very much the decision of this area. Uh, as, a, as a teacher, I was very fortunate because my little baritone uh, singer was this production. Uh, it, it was the last production of uh, great uh, Maris Janssen's mm. conductor. Yeah. And the stage director uh, of the German, I'm not sure I remember the name, so sorry about that. Uh, very famous. Uh, he offered the, this a picture when Lisa becomes Yelitsky's wife. And, uh, you know, the table, the big table, you know, uh, goes on the stage and uh, surrounded by children. And this is just, just such a common private happiness. Mm -hmm. You know, this is Aria about it, how it could be wonderful and how it would be uh, absolutely effortless and without any problem to make this marriage, to be married with him. Mm -hmm. It's a very, very clear idea, but immediately she doesn't accept it. And, and all this picture is crushed. 
So it's very clear. I remember another idea in the, the Wiener Staatsoper in the beginning of the 90s, uh, with the great Russian tenor Vladimir Atlantov and the great Russian director Vladimir Chernov, who was one of the best Zelensky in the history of recording. And when uh, Zelensky sang this aria, Herman was observed this uh, conversation between Lisa and Zelensky, and he became so crazy, so jealous. You know, and this contradiction between this, uh, this couple yeah. and him created the real drama on the stage while this extremely calm, beautiful aria. Uh -huh. So the drama in way existed in this aria, and you have to understand. And it's a wonderful long phrase. By the way, be careful with the, uh, the one of the last phrases. Uh, you have to to take a big breath before it. It's a uh, in very fine. Yeah. You have to think it in one breath perfectly. And the second thing, do you see a tempo? Yeah. After the words, yes, 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 yes. And then, Я вас люблю, люблю без верна, без вас не мыслю я пожи. It would be so lovely to sing it on one breath. Okay, yeah. I always disagree for an instance, uh, the singing on one breath, with one breath, uh, uh, in the, the best scene from Don Cut. Yeah. You know, for me it sounds a little bit strange where the, the person is shooting through by Arctic Goose and singing this long, long <laughs> phrase, enjoying himself how great the singer is. I believe it's out of the situation, yeah. it's out of the, it's my private opinion, okay. I disagree with that. I, and usually the baritone looks like a very, very proud goose singing this song. I believe it's, it, it just destroys the... Yeah, I agree. But we here... Don't, we don't feel sorry for him. And we feel just, oh, he's such a good technician. He has such a long breath. <laughs> I believe it's not such a good idea in this technician. Anyway, it's not a sport. But in this side, it works. It works. Because, you know, he's really noble. In the beginning of this order, Lisa said, uh, who is handsome, who is noble, who is, you know, such a, has such a strange feature, you know, it's him, but why I don't like him, why? So, he has to look like that, he's like absolutely ideal man. Yeah. And for some ladies, it's awful, they don't like it. They would like to, to take some clochard from the way and to be with him because he's interesting. He's, he's not interesting for her. And he feels it. And you know all these uh, bars with the first accompaniment. This is Lisa's efforts to, to run away. And he started this aria with, with the rest of it. Yeah, that you missed. So I didn't sorry, I did. I know. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry, I, I didn't. Yeah, it, actually, I didn't found the the translation and the pronounce of the recitativo too, so I didn't vote good. for this. But good. I studied to. I my interest was to yes. sing it to you no, on no, the no. area. I understand. Understand. But anyway, I appreciate. It. I highly appreciate that you brought this. One of the most complicated but beautiful from the Russian repertoire. And I believe you have to sing it. You have to sing it. Of course. Uh, uh, just to find out the no noble colors, extremely noble color signals, equality of your registries, and the beauty of the sound, 
and uh, effortless legato singing. Effortless legato singing. And you know, there are so few real operators who can sing this area really perfect. And the best of them, I believe one of the best of them is Ludovic Desiguet, who did the Tapira Basti fantastically. It's a perfect Russian pronunciation. This is such a gorgeous line. He's not really so real now, but anyway, not just Russian pronunciation, it's fine with the, the, the number of uh, words. So, uh, we have very short time, and yeah. if you don't mind, we start again, and I will stop it. Okay. Good. Remember, remember, remember one, uh, one uh, ring in Russia. Uh, it, it's not in, compar in, in comparison with Italian. The uh, unvoiced consonants don't become voiced before the, the bright consonants, like uh, it, it was a permanent mistake. Uh, S, V, S and V, it was Zvershit, it's not Zvershit, S, this is double. Okay. The double sound, you know? Zvershit. Okay, let's start the other. Zvershit. Я вас люблю, please, no, any shadow of E, wow, just very soft L, very soft L and U. Could you, could you, could you speak, could you, could you tell me? Lu, 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 lu. Yeah, more kiss. Lu blue. This is right. Lu blue. Yes. Okay, let's start again. Ya vas lu blue. Lu blue vas mierna. Sometimes you lose it. Dot, dot a trick on the same. No. Dots. Ah, okay. Nya Prajit. Nya Prajit. Yes. Yes. Eight with dot and then 60. So okay. we have to, yes. Uh, yes. to follow this way. It's very important for this area because Tchaikovsky was in, on this way a little bit different than Capricious. Sometimes he put it in the same, the repeating. Repeated phrases, different trick. Just pay okay. attention for that. Then, this, ne, uh, these are close. So they're not bad, so last. Could you close the button with this? This was, ne, this This is difficult for you, dnia. This is D and soft F. No, any E. Dnia, dnia, dnia. But this is important word, be careful. Yeah. Could you repeat could you just in speaking? Без yeah. вас не мислю дня прожит. Без вас не мислю дня прожит. Yes, remember that in Russian, it's not like in Italian. So this is this is not voice uh, S. This is just S. S. Yes. Understand me? Yeah. Not мислю. Not not, it's not okay. that. This is S. Мислю. Без вас. Без вас. Again. Без Без вас не мислю дня, дня прожит. 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 Yes, again. Без вас не мислю дня праж, прожит. Прожит. The stress, the, the, the strong syllable, the stress syllable will be вас. Прожит. 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 Again, but now could you pronounce it? Could you could you speak like a drama actor, like theater di 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 prose? Без вас не мис без вас не мислю дня прожит. Slower. Без вас не мислю дня прожит. Okay, uh, 
makes your business a very special Russian uh, one. It's very special. Uh, so it's, it sounds like E with the addition of umlaut on the way to Mist. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Much better. So some Russians uh, consider this wow like that, but it's not that. It's a little bit fancy. Understand what it is? Yeah. Fancy. This uh, could, we, could, could we sing it? Uh, I would like to give you just some ideas about how to work in Russian text and how to to be relaxed with the pronunciation, singing such a uh, demanding, beautiful lines. Okay. So, without trying, without extra efforts to be precise, <laughs> you have to calm down with the pronunciation. You have to, to work on that to be very confident. Yeah. And when you appear on the stage, even if you are in doubts about is it correct or not correct, you have to bring your uh, self confidence on the stage, as, I, as we talked before with your colleagues. Yeah. It's important for any language. This is why it sounds a little bit strange, but it's, it's true. It's mm -hmm. true. What we need to be a great singer. The first point, this is a joke, but it's right. A great self-confidence. If we have it, we can cover even our problems. Yeah. But just not in the studio, not in the class, on the stage. Okay, try again. Yavas will do from the very beginning to see. Was lovlo, lovlo bez mierna, bez važne mišlju ne pražni. Look, 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 not bad, not, not bad, but just a kind of mislu, mislu, this is S. Mislu. Listen, this is pretty high up. With the high tissue. When you're going up uh, very, very high in the tessitura, in this area, especially in this area, you have to keep the kind of stretch on the way the control of your breath. Understand what I mean? Yeah. So you shouldn't just you should you uh, uh, you, sh you shouldn't just exhale. Understand what I mean? Yeah. So you have to to have this arc, mm. understand what I mean? Yeah. And yeah. then higher, then higher you are, the more you're stretching this arc. Okay. And I don't see, I don't see it in your technique. Okay. Because it's not. Uh, 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 we have some high arc in tenor, but like like uh, Largo Cantor, for instance. But it's not so such a gap. It's not such a compact. Yeah. But what the highest Italian. Uh, Aria for lyric baritone. Very colonized, it's not so high. What else? Um, but usually Italian composers Italian, wrote for, maybe for the full baritone sound. Also, right. German Aria is very high. Right. Right. Yes, this. Uh, it's um, very, very similar. And also the, the same problem because there are a number of words in John Monsanto. Yeah. If you remember. Yeah. So you have to sing this area exactly like German. Okay. Exactly like German. Keeping the same quality of beautiful line. And could have this was project and try now. Don't be so tense with the pronunciation. Forget it for a while. And try to produce the most beautiful line here, like German. Ja was lovlo, lovlo bez mierna, bez was ne mislu ne obrazi. Very 
important point that, and we finish, uh, we finish our master class. Okay. So uh, you are a little bit pushing it out on the, pushing it out or on the direction of the yeah, and I can see your shelters that are moving, you know, up. Yeah. Understanding. So immediately it means that your whole body, your entire body is not involved in this work. Mm -hmm. But now it's very complicated to explain the, the, the details of that, but you have to, to feel that. And shelters, it's our indicator. Mm -hmm. If you're getting like that, you think, I see this kind of movement and tension, so it means that, that it's not correct in breath support. Okay. In breath support, it's have to, you have to feel it like a, like a ball in the water. And mm -hmm. then higher than the ball is going, uh, more dead in the water, and you can feel you can feel this kind of resistance. The same happens with your body, with your muscles that uh, are responsible for support. And could you finishing our lesson? Uh, could you sing? Yes, You understand this, this word, leaning on this ball. But this movement and this resistance is very elastic. Okay. It's not push, it's not uh, it's not spingere, it's leaning, appoggiare, very, very elastic. Show me the uh, this word. This was the Muslim Nyaprashi, Jarta. This was the Mislunia Prajit, Yabod Vixi, was premier. Okay, 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 okay. Like that. Yeah. And listen to your work. Okay. And you will hear this, the kind of, uh, the kind of, uh, uh, piano music. That you're crying or complaining for something, it means it means that it's not supported enough. Okay. And it's gonna uh, when we are crying and, or or, or uh, uh, complaining for something, like, oh, mama, I, I so, like so this direction of the muscles, this direction of the shoulders, body, etc. So you must be more confident. You have to open your body like a fan. The fan. Okay. Direction like that, and, and then send you stand like support for okay. The same in this kind of direction. Think about it. Thank think you. This advice probably it is not so helpful, but it's a, a big reason to think about. Now it is. And this area, despite of your difficulties, very, very useful. Thank you. And thank you for your thank you for your patience, uh, guys, colleagues, uh, everybody. It was really very interesting, and then more than more fluent I felt myself while this uh, 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 online masterclass it was not so usual for me. But it, thank you for that. But Dimitri, you were wonderful. So uh, actually, we would have uh, the last one, but uh, if. Uh, if you, it's too late, uh, it's okay. Yeah. Uh, and uh, if you will find some time, free time, I, I, I'm ready to come to join you again. But I have a concert with my guys in half of an hour. Okay. In so half of an hour. <laughs> don't worry, don't so, worry. Anyway, uh, so. Dima, thank you, thank you, thank you. Really has been a pleasure. And uh, we are very honored to have you here. Me too. Really? This is a famous, glorious, great festival. And to be the part of that, it's a big honor. I appreciate it. And I'm always with you guys and toy 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 for the concert and toy 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 for the final production. And we will wait yeah. for you next year. Thank you. Thank you. And you know where I'm waiting for you. Yes. <laughs> Okay.